What's going down people? My name is Jack. Welcome back to another video here on my channel. If you're new here, I produce daily content based around video editing, videography, and how to make money, make a video. Subscribe if that sounds interesting to you. Today we're going to be creating this sequence on the screen right here. We're going to download some sample clips which are available for download in the description. And we're going to build this sequence. And it's totally for free on this video editor online called InVideo. If you want to sign up to InVideo at any time, you can sign up throughout this video by clicking the top link in the description. You will sign up everything's totally free there's a paid plan but the actual you know method we're going to be exploring in this video is 100 free let's stop wasting time because at the end of the day i value your time let's jump onto the computer what's going down with it what's going down with it this is the site on the screen right now and uh basically it's a free editor so if you want to actually follow through the exact clips beat and particles i'm going to be using and overlays and stuff download that there's a link in the description sign up to the or visit the website it's the first link in the description without further ado let's jump into it right so there's actually two different plans the free one which is no watermark nothing like that but the only change is that you can only do up to five minute videos and the videos are in 720p so if you want to pay for it that's up to you same link gets you the paid version or the free version by all means grab the free one to start with maybe you move on to the paid one later that's totally up to you let's do it so you have a couple different options actually let me let me take the hood down all right I'm, I'm feeling I'm feeling hoodless today all right not hardless but hoodless uh, what would you like to do today you can convert articles to videos using this you can use pre-made templates which I've explored before or you could actually tell them that you're a pro video editor and you want to start from scratch we're gonna do that today we're just gonna use the normal start from scratch video editor, right? And it lets us know what do we want? Do we want to create something that's a square video, a vertical video, or just a normal video? I'm gonna go with just a normal video. Start project. Using stock footage, blah, 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 blah. Everything's totally royalty free in here. So they got music for you, all that type of stuff. But today, we're gonna be supporting my main man, uh, Invade King, who makes the beats for my channel, or who's made the one beat which is stuck around for my channel. And we're gonna be using his beat to create this. So we're using custom everything, right? Now, First off, what I want to do is upload my actual content, right? So once you've actually made your editor, it'll load up with this sort of sample sequence. Let's just delete uh, the, the current elements in here because I don't, I don't actually want anything in here. Um, you can't delete the scene yet, but let's go to uploads down here and it's going to fetch the uploads. Now, I already have my clips imported, right? Because I've done that to save time. I sort of did a pre-work through this, this thing so I knew what I was going to create before I did the video, etc., right? So I've got all this. That's the exact clips that are available for download in the description. So download them if you want to work through and follow along exactly what I'm doing, but don't download them if you don't want to follow along. No problem at all. So what do we do? We start with clip number one. I'm actually going to grab the first clip in the sequence, as you, you might have briefly saw. I'm just going to drag it. I'm going to drop it, right? It's going to perfectly add it to my sequence. Everything is looking pretty solid to me. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty happy with this. Um, I can actually preview it if I want by pressing down here and it's going to play through. And by the way, they severely massacre the quality um, just literally just because of um, the fact that they need to uh, basically keep it so uh, the preview is coming relatively quickly. Uh, but don't worry, everything looks perfect at the end, all right? So I'm, I'm previewing my, my clip right here. Nice, looking pretty good, awesome, I'm happy with that. Now let's actually here go to duplicate, which is going to duplicate the scene because each clip is put in a different scene, right? Um, and then I just want to hover over the clip. I'm just going to delete the clip, right? So the clip's gone from scene number two. Let's drag the next clip in. The next clip, I think, is me stepping over something. Here it is. And it's literally a drag and a drop. We're going to build this quick. And the fun stuff is coming in a second when I start putting effects and uh, transitions and stuff like that. I promise you that stuff is going to get a lot of fun. Um, now let's actually just duplicate it again. Simple, duplicate it again, not a problem at all. And in fact, I'm going to try a different method for uh, for throwing the new clip in here. I'm just going to drag and drop, and I'm going to click replace. So if you want to drag something over the top of this, you could add as a layer, add behind, or just straight up replace it. So I'm just going to replace it. I think that might be quicker than, than even deleting it, right? I'm going to duplicate that again. I'm going to look for my next clip which is literally just duplicating the scene. I'm going to scroll down here. It looks like this is my next clip here. Again, drag it in, replace it out. Replace, replace, replace. Duplicate again. Yes, please. I wouldn't mind to. Let's duplicate it one time. Um, there you there you go. There you go. What's the clip after that? I believe it's this clip here. Awesome. Um, and drag and drop that. Let's actually duplicate it one more time. Yes, please. Yes, please. There you go. Not too shabby, not too shabby. What's getting me walking through the woods, which I believe is our last clip. So if we actually click preview. We can actually watch this. Uh, oh, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. Um, let me actually see. So preview would actually preview the actual scene. What we need to do to preview the whole thing is go up here to preview and export. So if we click that, it'll start it from, from the start. It's an 18-second sequence at the moment. 
and I could hear that there's some sort of nonsense audio that's going on in the background. So we gotta change, we gotta change the audio. That's for a hundred percent, right? Continue editing. We're not done. Just put some nonsense music there. Looks like this is the nonsense music that they put. I'm not feeling it. I mean, for something, maybe a good flower garden promo video. Maybe a nursery, a nursery school promo video. But for my video, no thank you. So we're gonna open this up, my collection, and we're gonna go to Y2 Mate Free Hard Diss Track. This is the one. This is this is my main man. I've renamed it in the project for you guys. Beat by Invade King. Check out Invade King, straight legend, uh, OG of the channel. We're gonna bless this. There you go. Sounded a little bit better. Perfect. That sounded a little bit more to my liking personally, right? So now we can preview again and see what it's looking like. Nice. Sounding good to me. 100% sounding good. That's one thing I want to do quickly, which is just bring the actual background, uh, the background music up, right? The background music's got to be up. Let's preview this again. There you go. See, the audio was low before. Nice. So we bring the, the background music up. Let's bring the audio down. I want no audio from the clips. I want the background music uh, all the way, right? So I'm clicking through. It looks like it's on 4% for some reason on all of these clips. That might, might just be the default. That's no worries. Let's bring them down. Bring the background music up and the audio volume. Oh, wow. I just realized you can't even see this. Two seconds. My bad. This is a thing that I do sometimes accidentally is I forget my face cam down here. But you see how over here the audio volume and the background music. So let me just redo what I've just been doing. I've just been on this clip and the background music was down here at, at like 4%. Um, and, and the audio was all the way up. So I'm just switching these around. Okay. My bad. Thank you that I thank you to me that I fucking noticed that. Right. Um, but we're, we're sorting it out. I'm clicking along. I'm putting everything at zero. You see, there you go. That one hasn't been done. 70% looks like the max we could do. Audio volume back down to zero. Let's bring me over. Woo! I'm glad I saw that so that you guys actually saw what I'm even doing. It would be confusing if you didn't know what I was doing. I'm, I'm pretty glad that, that we caught that one, right? Now, this right here is the bit where it gets pretty interesting. So we've built all these different clips. They play after each other. We've got a song that's full volume, nice, everything's sounding good. This is literally just me walking uh, around by my office. This is like two minutes down from my office, right? And I'm just, me, me and the homie Luke, shout out to Luke. Uh, we're basically recording some clips for a video editing contest that I was doing about a month ago, right? And they can be. Cool. It's looking good to me. I'm happy with it, right? Only thing is, there's a final scene that I want to put in there with some text, okay? So what I want to do is go here to duplicate. Uh, duplicate it again. Yes, please. And I want to actually drag in the uh, uploads and I want to drag in this, which is some particles. Replace. And this right here, you can preview it, is just a whole bunch of cool particles or whatever, right? So I like it. It's pretty, it's pretty cool indeed. Um, and what I want to do to this is actually add some text. So we go over here to text. We click it. Um, now, what sort of text do I want? I want some modern style text, maybe. What sort of stuff have they got for us? This is the cool stuff. Is the pre-built animated um, animated scenes, right? You get so much pre-made stuff here, guys. It's actually hilarious. Uh, it's worth getting this just for the pre-made stuff. The pre-made stuff is awesome. Um, the Broadway lights look look pretty cool. I'm just going to drag in. I'm just going to click that, adding. So it's adding it. Broadway lights, I'm going to drag that to the middle. And I'm going to click it. And I'm going to say, uh, walk in the park. Walk in the park by Jack Cole. Boom. Walk in the park by Jack Cole. Let's preview this. Let's see what it's looking like. Nice. So it's looking cool, you know what I mean? It's, you know, it's a little bit cheesy or whatever, but I'm happy with it. At the end of the day, it's just a cool pre-made piece of text, and uh, I'm, I'm personally very happy with that. Now, um, let's actually make sure that we're not losing any volume on this section. It doesn't look like I can even find any volume on this section. All good, not a problem at all. Now let's go back and, and retrace my sex to what I was talking about a second ago, right? I want to go to default. This little thing in the middle re represents transitions. So if we click that, we know that we have a whole bunch of different transitions. You could use these sort of transitions right here, which is looking pretty nice. Let's try that one out. Let's, let, let's throw it there, right? Let's, let's just throw it on there and we'll see what happens, right? I'm just going to test out a couple different ones. I know in the, in the sequence I showed you, it was all glitches, but for the sake of mixing it up, let's see what this looks like, right? Nice. So that looks pretty cool. It looks pretty effective. I'm, I'm rolling with that. Um, I'm actually going to I'm going to bring a couple more. Foam roll to the right. Interesting. So these are looking just kind of nuts. Let's click on them again, and we're going to see what this next transition looks like. I think there's a lot of useful transitions here that are pre-made. You know, we've just clicked two buttons. 
Let's have a look. Nice. It's looking pretty good. Okay. That, that one looked a little bit forced, but I'm, I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. Let's, let's roll on to the next one. I want to see what happens next, right? Film rolled down. Interesting, interesting, interesting. The cross zoom was was definitely my favorite. I'm just I'm gonna have a look. I'm gonna have a look at what else we got down here. What else we got? Overlays. So we got the circle overlays. That's looking relatively interesting. I'm not too sure about that. Um, and I'm literally just looking through these different thumb, um, these different transitions. They give us a little preview, right? You got these light light leaks. Okay, interesting. Is there anything that fully suits it? All right, let's try this one. I want to see what this this one's looking like. See, we got all these different transitions to use. This is very cool, in my opinion. Um, so let's give it a play. Let's see what we've done so far. Yeah. Okay. Nice, 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 nice. I'm, I'm personally loving this so far, right? I'm absolutely loving it. I'm going to go to the next transition. Um, I'm going to go down to these, to these light leaks again and see if I got anything else that's just a little bit less... Less obvious. Nah, it's not looking like we got loads. We got the brush, shutter. Okay, that's looking not not great. I'm gonna use the glitches. The glitches is actually what I went with first. First off, right? The glitches were pretty cool in my opinion. I'm I'm pretty happy with the glitches. The glitch effect is something people want as it is. So I'm gonna throw that one in the middle right there. Um, and then I'm gonna actually just throw uh, that that zoom again, cross zoom in on the final clip, and then maybe a glitch on the final one, right? So maybe digital break, short sure, digital break. All right. So now I think we've built something that's pretty goddamn cool. Let's preview and export. Well, let's preview first, then potentially export next. Let's have a look. Okay. There you go. That was a little interesting. Not too sure what I think of that final one. That one right there worked out all right. And just like that, we built a cool customized sequence that we can export totally for free. Looks like that final final scene goes on for hella long. Screw it, screw it. That's looking relatively interesting. The final sequence goes on for quite some time, man. This scene duration goes on for 25 seconds. We don't need the 25 seconds, right? I'm just going to make that 10. 10 seconds. Um, are you sure you're going to change the duration of frame of that video has in it? Scene duration. Uh, your video getting cut. No problem. Change it to 10 seconds. Preview and export. I'm just going to look at this one more time. Actually, you know what? I've got a feeling to make this 11 seconds. Let's, let's have a look at what happens now. There you go. I feel better with it being 11 seconds. The reason for that, my reason, was because the total duration was 32. And my lucky number is 33. Therefore, to be off by one... That would be an unlucky number, but now we're all good. We changed it. It's looking fine. Invade King Beats. Nice, 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 nice. Shout out to Invade King Beats. He got his, uh, his little audio mark. Nice. I'm loving this, person. Nice. Perfect. I'm going to click export. That looked good to me. I'm rolling with it. Uh, let's click export. And it's saying some editing tips. It gives you a couple tips or whatever. Uh, help us build. Give the feedback. I'm sorry, NVIDIA. I'm not giving the feedback today. I'll give maybe in the future. Um, but shout out to the guys at NVIDIA. We get on Skype calls. <laughs> Blessing to you guys. They're very good. Um, let's have a look. So now it's going to process. Now, this particular part of it, because it's downloading everything and processing everything off the internet, this takes a little minute, right? So what I'm going to do here is... I'm just going to take a break for a second, right? I'm going to walk away from the computer. I'm going to go get a drink of water. I'm going to come back and I'm actually going to, I'm going to set a timer right now and we can see how long it actually takes to, um, to, 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 to basically process, right? So, uh, let's have a look. Stopwatch. The stopwatch is on. Okay. The stopwatch is on. Let me go down here. What's up people? How's it going? The other angle. I'm bringing back the other angle. The stopwatch is on. Okay. And I'm going to go get some water. I'm going to come back and we're, we're basically going to see, I'm just going to cut and we're going to see what happens, um, after I got my water and how long that it actually takes to process this video. See you in a minute. I ah, hit my knuckles. See you in a second. Boom. There we go. Completed. Awesome. So we are on 2 minutes 29 seconds. Let's stop. 2 minutes 30 seconds, which is a little bit over actually than what it, what it fully took. 2 minutes 30 seconds for your video to be processed. Now we're on the computer over here. We can hover over it. There's a button in the top right that says download. Let's click it. It looks like they've screwed me though. It's 32 seconds. God damn it. 
Re-render. No, it's gonna be fine. All right, I'm throwing the uh, the headphones back on. Let's actually click this this particular video, um, and it looks like it's come up on the other monitor. Let's bring it over here. Bring it to the beginning. Make it a little bit smaller so it's just a bit more digestible. Awesome, and let's give this a play. Cool. Nice. Nice. It's a little subtle glitch. Nice. And it comes in on the drop. That's perfect. Yes. There you go. Walk in the Park by Jack Cole. Even though it's not a park, it doesn't matter. It's fine. There you go. Oh. Amazing. And that right there, people, is in video. If you have not signed up yet and you just enjoyed watching the video, first off, thank you for watching the video. Glad you enjoyed. But second off, Download it. It's linked down below. It's 100% for free. We were utilizing the free version, right? Which means you could do videos 720p. There's no watermark, none of that nonsense. Create videos up to five minutes and uh, you can't resell the videos. So my freelancers, if you guys want to freelance on this, uh, go ahead and grab the, uh, the monthly plan or the yearly plan, which makes it half the price, right? And you can get 1080p videos, all that type of stuff. But that's boring. You go do that if you want to do that. I'm not going to sell it to you. The link is in the top line of the description to get that. Um, and at the end of the day, I appreciate you guys for joining in on the video. Thank you for watching. Nothing but a pleasure. I'm going to take my headphones off. I'm actually kind of hungry right now, people. So I'm going to go ahead and grab some of my goddamn lunch. I got this out of the fridge when I went to, when I get to, went to get my water. You want to see this cup that I got? Let me show you this cup one time. Got this from a charity store. It's obviously in the shape of a lens. You know what I mean? Legendary. I think, you know, you're not a real filmmaker till you start getting fucking shit like this. Just nonsense novelty items based around your profession. Hilarious. Thank you seriously for watching the video. If you made it to the end, you are a very small percent. I think only 5% of people make it to the end of my videos. I really got to work on that. That's a very small percentage. But if there's a large number of people viewing the videos, the small percent still equals a lie. I don't know. That's a mathematical equation that I'm working on. I'm going to go fucking bust out the calculator. <laughs> See you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Peace out. Oh, fuck. Follow me on Instagram or Twitter or Facebook. At Jack Cole. I'm super active. I respond to everybody. Sweet. See you later.